Hey everyone, welcome back to another The Mori's Place Let's Play of Animal Crossing GameCube. We have got a special episode today because I believe it's in this letter here. We guaranteed sell out. We just got some beautiful hand drawn wallpapers in stock. These special rolls will be sold in an exclusive one hour sale at 4 pm on August 14th. Well, it is August 14th and it's almost 4 pm. We didn't quite get there exactly on time, but I thought it would also be cool to check out what it looks like before, kind of what wallpapers are there first, and then come back at 4 pm to see what other wallpapers are there. So we'll just quickly check our mail as well. Hmm. Uh, it looks like we've just got fossil. Oh, one from Snooty. Oh no! <laughs> Hi there! You're doing well, I hope. I've moved. I live in Crew now, so make sure you come see me once in a while and you'd better visit or I'll pout. Oh, well, good riddance, Snooty. Um, I think she was. She wasn't our least favourite, but she was the one we got on with the worst, I would say. Uh, oh, 13,000 HRA points. Awesome. We'll check our fossils later. But before we go to Tom Nooks and check out what wallpapers he has, I just have to thank, of course, the channel members Xander and Caroline, who are supporting these Let's Play series on this channel as Marvelous Maury. Thank you so much for your continued support. It really helps me just set time aside for recording and editing these episodes. So thank you. Anyway, without further ado, let's go over to Nooks. We've got a bunch of stuff to sell any Anyway, uh, and probably some duplicate fossils, but more importantly, we want to have a look at what will. Oh! Oh, I see! So it's not even open yet! Today's special event will begin soon! Oh, how exciting! I never knew this was a thing! Today's special event will begin soon. Okay, so we've got kind of. Well, 10 minutes to kill, I guess! Oh, Snooty's house is no longer here. Savannah is living all by herself. Good morning. Oh, whoops. I guess it's kind of late to be saying that, isn't it? Yeah, it's kind of late in the afternoon now. You know, it's times like these that make me think the whole greeting thing is difficult. So tell me, Maury, what did you want? Uh, just hanging? Don't you just love spending your whole day fishing out by the river or maybe at the beach? I'm sure you've caught a ton of fish, Maury. You have, haven't you? Uh, we've caught a few, of course. Oh, I was trying to be sarcastic, but I'm not very good at it. <laughs> well, if you're bored enough to catch all those fish, why don't you help some people in need? They'll probably appreciate your help, and you might even be rewarded with a gift. Sure. Just get rid of that weed. Okay, let's go and talk to Copper. See if there are any goings on. Oh, is that a new... Oh no, that wasn't a new villager. That was Nate coming out of his house. Okay, Copper, hello. Good day to you. Well, aren't we a busy little bee buzzing to and fro? Commendable behavior. Tell me, how can Officer Copper be of assistance? Um, there isn't anything of particular import to report. Okay, by the way, Maury, have you ever received any music from Tota Keke? I mean, KK Slider. If what I've heard is indeed true, he has more than 50 tunes in his repertoire. That's a staggering sum. I've even heard there are some tunes he won't play unless you request them. I find this interesting. Just once, I'd like to dig those jams. I mean, hear one of those undoubtedly well-composed songs. Look at Officer Copper trying to be all proper. <laughs> okay, anyone at the plaza? Oh, Robin, hello. We've got not a lot going on today by the looks. Oh, is there any new villagers? Oh, who's this? <gasps> Freya! Moved in near our fruit. I hope she hasn't moved in on top of our fruit. I'm sorry, but I'm in a hurry right now, hun. Oh, oh, my mistake. I, it's Maury, isn't it, huh? I thought you were going to hit me, hit on me or ask me for a favour, hun. I seem to be just as popular with the boys and girls alike, you know? Everyone wants to be my friend. Ah, sometimes it's just too much, hun. By the by, did you need something, hun? Need a favour? Let me think. No, I'm afraid I've done everything worth doing, hun. Okay. Can't blame you. Okay, let's see. I don't... Oh, yeah, we didn't plant anything here, did we? Our tr money tree is growing. I think it might be time to have a look at our golden shovel tree as well, up near the post office. But let's have a look at... Introduce ourselves to Freya. Are you home? 
I'm not in right now. Oh! That's weird. I thought they always came out of their house. Okay, here's our fruit trees, so that's good. A bit further north than I thought they were. So where might Freya be? Okay, before we do anything else, how long have we got? We've got, ooh, seven minutes. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> We need to, is this our, there we go. Our shovel, we need to dig up some fossils ready to send off. Check it out, I dug up a fossil. Oh, Freya! Oh no, not another fan. Oh, course my, curse my movie star looks and winning personality. No? You say your name is Maury? Is that so? Huh, then you're still not a fan? My name is Freya, it's been sort of a pleasure meeting you. Oh. Thank you. Well, welcome to Moriland. We'll have to send you a letter later. And maybe a welcome present. Has our tree fully grown? That is the question. Oh, a camper, of course! Oh, it, I think it has fully grown. Here we go. Yes! <laughs> another, another golden... Shovel, we can leave one of these down by the dock now and take it to the river. Uh, should we go and see who the camper is? <gasps> Pinky! Well, welcome to my tent. You just come on in. I've always got time to say hi to another camper. Wait, you don't look like you're camping at all. I guess that's okay. Not great, but okay. My name's Pinky and you're Maury. Well, Maury, I totally suggest you take up camping. Okay, maybe we will. What item have we got to... We've got a daffodil. Do you want to play a game? Maury, you're just the kind of person I was hoping to meet on my camping trip. One of the best things about camping is trading cool camping tales with your fellow campers. Some people like ghost stories, but I'm really into wild and crazy mountain climbing tales, Cubby. I'm actually hoping this trip will end up providing me with a cool new tale to tell. Well, maybe it will if we, we play some games. Maury, you're just the kind of person... Oh, no. Let, we need to play some games. Okay, maybe we'll have to go out and come back in again. How long have we got? Five minutes. This seems to be going very slow till Nooks opens. Never experienced a sale, so I'm very curious to... If he will only be selling wallpaper? I don't know. Yeah, I don't have any ghost stories, apart from the fact we did bump into Wisp the other day. But I'm hoping to play a game. Oh, you're too happy! Oh, I mean, you can't be too happy, I guess, but... So tell me about the first peak you ever bagged. Oh, you don't know what I'm talking about, do you? No, not really. Maury, you're just the kind of person I was hoping to meet on my camping trip. It's not like my camping trip has been totally perfect so far, because it has. I'm just longing for those inter-camper bonds you forge when you share tales with fellow campers. So tell me about the first peak you ever bagged. Oh, yes, we, we don't know what you... Maybe we'll try later. I guess you don't really want to play games. Okay, we may as well go and check the town dump. Um... Will there be anything? Oh, some outfits. We've got Chain Gang and the Fresh Shirt. What is the... F oh, no, our pockets are full. We'll have to come back. I hope we can sell things to... Um, to Nook. While we're waiting, we might as well head down to the dock and just drop off our spare golden shovel near the dock. Uh, I've forgotten where we are. Oh, no, it's completely disorientated. I thought we were down near Sydney's house. We need to go down the ramp. And we'll leave the golden shovel here, just so we can pick it up next time we go to the island. Uh, I think it will be okay just to if we leave it here, I guess. There we go. No one's going to steal it, I don't think. I hope not, anyway. Okay, there's no... No other stuff going on on the beach. I was wondering if Gulliver might be here today. I think he comes once a week. Or maybe it's once a month. I don't know. Okay, let's go and talk to Robin. 
Robin, how are you this fine afternoon slash early evening? I'm sorry, but I'm in a hurry right now, la -dee -da. Oh, oh, my mistake, it's Maury, huh? I thought you were going to hit on me or ask me for a favour. I seem to be just as popular with boys and girls alike, you know? Everyone wants to be my friend. Ah, sometimes it's just too much, la -dee -da. Enough idle chit-chat. Do you need something from me? Can I help? You always shop just when I'm thinking about you, Maury. Oh, good. Will you really help me? In that case, can you please go to Tybalt's house and get my videotape? Tybalt's borrowed my stuff and then never returns it. Beware that scoundrel. So, will you do this for me, I guess? You've heard my request. Run along now. Okay. We certainly have heard the request. Um, Tybalt lives all the way over here. Even now, our town doesn't feel small, does it? It still feels really massive. Uh, Tybalt, where are you? There you are. Didn't think you were going to be home for a second. Boy, howdy, Maury. You're looking like a picture of health. Grr. Yeah, you look great. Huh? Not as great as I do? Well, what an odd thing to say. I guess that's cool. Tell me, Maury. What's new? Um, I'm picking up. So it's time to pay the piper, huh? Someone finally got around to taking back that stupid videotape. God, I can't take it anymore. I lent it to Savannah. Look, I'm sorry. Super sorry. Is that good enough for you? It's not here, I swear. Go talk to Savannah. Savannah will tell you everything. Oh, no. Luckily, oh, that's the chime for the four o'clock. It should be. Yep, four o'clock, which means Nooks should be open now. And also, we need to talk to Savannah anyway, so it's a good way to... Good thing we're coming over this way. Okay, I've never been to this before, so let's see. Oh, just wallpapers, it looks like. Welcome, aren't you lucky? We just happen to be having a special event today. Free balloons for... Ev oh, wow! Free balloons! I had no idea! Welcome to my humble store. I don't have much, but take your time and look around. Yes. Free balloons. How do we open? Yellow balloon. Oh, wow. Okay, he seems to be out of stock, but we've got three wallpapers. That's a groovy wall. It's very nice. Would you like to see it? Uh, let me see it. Wow. I think we've seen this one before. Well, hmm, do you like it? That price is a mere 1,280 bells. How can I afford to let it go so cheap? Well, that's the secret of the shop trade. Would you like it? Never mind. No, you sure? Well, no matter. Feel free to keep browsing. What about this one? It's a cabin wall. Very nice. Uh, I th let's see the cabin wall. I think we will need a cabin wall. Hmm, do you like it? That price is a mere 1,200 bells. Actually, I've just realized I think we have a cabin wall. I think that's the wallpaper you get in the huts on the island. So maybe we don't need the cabin wall after all. Uh, we also need... To, are you still buying things? Yes, yes, what can I do? Oh, good. You're still buying things. Uh, we can get rid of all this stuff. We're going to keep the item on us because we might need to trade that with the camper. And we probably need to keep some watermelon paper as well. If I add it up, my price comes to 3,572 bells. Will you sell? Yes. Thanks much. Tell me, is there anything else you wish to sell? Not at the moment. But we will check the last paper here. That's a blue trim wall. Very nice. Uh, yeah. Oh, I, yeah, I like... Actually, I like that. Yeah, I'm, I wasn't sure, but I think I do like it. Yeah. How can I afford to let it go so cheap? Well, that's the secret of the shop trade. I'll buy it. Thanks much. 1,420 bells. Thanks much. Please take this raffle ticket as a gift. No charge. The next raffle date is August 31st. I bet you can't wait. I can't. So we, we're going to keep this down here. Oh, of course, we need to check our fossils. Because we might have to sell them. Um. Okay, what fossils did we get? We got amber again, of course. Ammonite. And a dinosaur egg. Ooh. We, we need to go and check what, we've, what we haven't got. Um, okay, so this job is open for an hour. I think we're going to get the resident of crew to come here so we can upgrade our shop as well. Uh, so we need to leave a paper for him to, to purchase. 
thank you. Do come again. I look forward to seeing you. Excellent. Oh, look at the blue. Yes. That's so cool. I hope we don't lose it. Oh, if it isn't Mori again. How nice. So, what can I do for you? Uh, I'm picking up. So, you came to get the videotape, right? Yeah, well, about that. Walt Jr. has it. I was forced to hand it over. Really, I had no say in the matter. I'd tell you about it, but it would take all day. I'm sorry, but you'll have to get it from Walt Jr. Oh, no. That's okay. Any excuse to run with our balloon? And actually, I wonder if we can get different color balloons. And then when the guy from Crew comes here to help upgrade our shop, maybe he can get a different color balloon. Walt Jr., are you home? Yes. No, I don't want any. I'm telling you for the last time, you foul creature. Go away. Oh, wait. It's just you. I thought it was another one of those weirdos handing out tissues. Hey, why are you even talking to me? I'm picking up a videotape. Oh, whoops. Are you going to take the videotape back to Robin? Well, then, here it is. I truly appreciate it. Thank you. I thought it was going to be a longer quest than that. I had a feeling we were going to go all around town. Okay, where was Robin? She was at the plaza. I love how cute this balloon is. Robin, are you still here? Ah, dear Maury, did you already have your lunch, la -dee -da? By the by, did you need something? Yeah, I'm here to deliver. There we go. I don't believe it, you actually managed to get my videotape back. Impressive, most impressive. You're incredible. So, I have to reward you. I hope you like money, because that's what I'm giving you. 697 bells. We'll take it. <laughs> well, I'm quite impressed at your performance. Perhaps I judged you too quickly. Thank you. Why are you judging me? Why is everyone judging me? <laughs> Stop judging me! Okay. Love carrying this balloon around. Um, almost to the point, I don't want to search for the money rock, because that means we'll have to put the balloon away. Nate. Good morning. Maury, it seems like you normally come talk to me about this time, right? Hey, no, it's not like I mind or anything. Yawn. Knock yourself out. Yeah, so, what do you need me for? Uh, can I help at all? Well, uh, nothing's exactly, you know, springing to mind. <gasps> oh yeah, duh, stupid. Here's something for you. How's about you take this watch over to Gwen's place? How does that grab you? Gwen came over to visit and then forgot. Seriously, an animal's called me a space case. So what do you say, pal? Think you can handle this epic quest? The return of the item. I'll do it. Well, that about sums up. I'm counting on you. Okay, luckily we know Gwen's at the plaza. Uh, I hope. <laughs> The plaza is always lower down than I remember. <laughs> Gwen! Ah, dear Maury, did you already have your lunch? Yes, and it was tasty. But let's get right to the point. What can I do for you? Um, I've got a delivery. Ah, my watch. That's rather odd. How did it come to be in your possession? Oh, really? Is that so? I left it at Nate's home, did I? Hmm. Well, you've saved me the trouble of having to pick it up myself, hon. How very excellent. I owe you a debt of gratitude for helping me, so I'd like to give you this furniture. I never liked it anyway. Thank you. Well, I'm quite impressed at your, uh, your performance. Perhaps I judged you too quickly. Stop judging me. Why is everyone judging me? Okay, what furniture did we get? A pine bonsai. I'm going to just set, oops, set up some letters for the museum quickly. Oh, I love the watermelon paper. May as well do... Oh, actually, let's send a... I've got Nate's e-reader card here. So you may as well send Nate a... Password. To Nate, here is your random password. And again, because you live in our town, hopefully you send us a rare item. We've been pretty lucky. We've got two NES games so far from previous episodes by doing this. So hopefully we can get more. There's a whole bunch of NES games to get. Uh, where were we going? I can't remember. 
Oh yes, we're going to the museum to double check which is the last fossil that we need from the, the smaller fossils. Because I believe we might accidentally be selling one when we need it. So we've got the amber. We've got the dinosaur track. We've got the dinosaur egg. And we've got a trilobite. So the ammonite, that is one we accidentally sell by the looks. Wake up, blathers! Oh! Hmm! What time is it? I'm so very sleepy. Oh dear me, a thousand pardons. So terribly sorry. I'm afraid I'm a bit of a night um, owl. Yes? Well, by the by, might there be something with which I could assist you? Sure. Splendid. What no doubt priceless item might you have for us today? An ammonite, which I, I, I'm pretty confident we've actually sold in the past. Well, ho, ho, again, an ammonite. My stars, a very impressive find. And yes, wonderful. This fossil is exceedingly superior quality. What, what? Now then, I know a thing or two about these creatures. Yes, indeed, ammonites. Those ammonites lived in shells. They were not shellfish, but rather mollusks, like occupy and squid. And the closest living relative to the ammonite is the chambered nautilus. Fascinating, no? Ammonites exist from the Devian period some 400 million years ago to the end of the Cretaceous period. Their extinction coincided with that of the dinosaurs. Time and tide wait for no, neither man nor beast, what? Oh ho, blathers, you ninny. I've gone and done it again, spewing out more information than necessary. So sorry. You have our deepest, most profound gratitude. Might there be anything else with which you donate? Nope, thank you. Your support is greatly appreciated. Truly it is. I earnestly hope we can count on your continued patronage. Okay, and we finally filled up this centerpiece. So now we have a complete T-Rex, a complete kind of the smaller fossils, and also the, is this the, oh, the mammoth. Yep, there we go. We've completed the mammoth because that's only two pieces. So we've got one, two, three, four, five more dinosaurs to complete. I can't believe we've had so many duplicates. Okay, where to now? We may as well go and give the camper a visit. And then I think what we'll do is we'll get the um, the owner of crew to visit and then so that will prompt our upgrade for nooks and then I think we'll, we'll have a bit of a break and come back because KK Slider should be performing tonight so maybe we'll come back and watch KK I think that'd be good especially since last week actually our oh our cherries are ready especially since last week our request was denied because I spelt it wrong where did the camper go I could have sworn they were here oh there it, there it, there it is <laughs> pinky Maury, you're just the kind of person I was hoping to meet on my camping trip one of the best things about camping is trading cool camping tales with your fellow campers. Some people like ghost stories, but I'm just really into wild, crazy mountain climbing stories. I'm actually hoping this trip will end up providing me with a cool new tale to tell. Why won't you play a game with me? Oh no, I guess you're just not in the gaming mood. So tell me about the first peak you ever bagged. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? No. Okay, so how much money have we got on us, actually? Actually, I think we need to go and plant a cherry before we forget. We're going to plant another cherry. Freya. Don't you be stealing my fruit from the fruit trees. Okay, we're going to have to put the balloon down for... Just a few minutes while we plant a... Oh. Have to be at the right angle, apparently. There we go. So now we'll have a, a cherry, an orange, and a pear. So we still need to find apples. Okay. Okay. 
I think we're going to swap over to Cruise Town and visit Moriland in a kind of weird opposite world. So I'll see you in a few seconds. Okay, we are now Ian, I, I believe, and we are in Cruise. So this is the random Stranger's Memory card we bought off eBay. And we're gonna use the character to travel to Moriland um, so we can trigger the upgrade to Nook's Cranny. But the question is, how do we feel about taking some of the items from this town? Because this player has a bunch of NES games. Oh, cockroaches! And he's got a lot of uh, stuff that we potentially want. And, whoa, a lot of things in, in pockets as well. Can we drop some tools? What else can we drop? <laughs> We're making a mess of this town right now. Um, but what is this? Um, we might as well pick up the Nez games. Oh, more cockroaches! So we've got, what have we got? Tennis? Balloon fight? Balloon fight again? Okay, I guess we can leave one here, can't we? And then what have we got here? Are oh, these all gonna be fossils? Wow, lots of fossils. I just find it so weird that at some point this player never booted up the game again and has left all these fossils. What have we got? The dinosaur track, the plesio torso, trilobite. Stego torso, dinosaur egg, and the right wing. Oh, is there anything else we want? I don't know if there is. I feel bad taking the NES games. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna get rid of some of the letters because I don't think they'll need the letters. What was this one? Oh, a letter, to, a letter to Ian from Nintendo. Dear Ian, welcome to Animal Crossing. What we've created isn't just another game, but a whole new experience. Invite your friends and family to join you in your brand new life, the AC development team. Oh, cool. That is, that is the letter you get when you first ever start the game, but you can only get it if you're the first person to use the memory card that actually comes with the game. So what else have we got here? Oh, Cube, Robin, Samson, Mitzi, lots of presents. A cabin clock. We've got a watermelon table. What is this? Knife and fork? What do we do with a knife and fork? Okay, we're just interested. We're getting distracted again, but we're interested in the presents. A flame shirt. How come our villagers never send us loads of items? A weeping fig. Wow. We might as well leave this stuff. I think we're just going to focus on delivering these two NES games while we trigger our shop upgrade. So let's finally travel to Moriland before we get any more distracted. Are you planning on going on a trip, Ian? Yes. Eeg, you must be very excited. Please wait here. I'll just be a moment. The next train should be arriving any minute now. So let's get you ready for departure, Eeg. Now I'm going to save town data for crew to memory card in slot A. Please wait a moment. I'm now saving town data. Do not turn off the power and do not remove the memory card. Thank you for your patience. Your pre-departure uh, pre preparations are now complete. And just in time, it looks like the train has just pulled in. Awesome. It's weird, us traveling to our own town. Here we go. Who will we meet? Rover, no doubt. Take care, farewell. Have a nice trip.
It's going to be weird arriving at our own town as someone else. Thank you for boarding. We hope your trip is both comfortable and enjoyable. Next stop is Moriland. Moriland! Remember, when we arrive at our destination, please wait until the train comes to a complete stop before standing. Preparing for arrival, please don't turn off the power or pull out the memory card. Thank you for waiting. The current local time in Moriland is 4.22pm on August 14th, 2021. We'll be arriving shortly. We hope you enjoyed the ride. Thank you. Hello, Rover. Again? Hey! Have we met before? Yeah! Wait, wait, wait! Don't tell me! You're... You're... Ian from Crew! Yes, yes, still got it! Score one for the old memory banks! How long has it been? Let me grab a seat. It's probably been a long time, to be fair. So what are you up to today? Are you moving again? Uh, we are taking a trip. I believe. I've always thought it was important to get out and see the world while you're young. And you still can. Wait, I'm still young. I need to see more of the world myself. What in the world am I talking about? So how are things, huh? How's life treating you over in crew? It's alright. Very weedy. Oh, just alright. I suppose that's not too bad. But sounds kind of lacking the excitement department. So that's why you're going to Moriland. You're going to whoop it up at a little party. Oh, we're about to pull into Moriland, and here I am babbling like a kitten with a catnip. Well, I hope you find some of that excitement you're looking for. Good luck painting the town red. Well, really, we're just coming to buy something. Hopefully, even though it's a sale with wallpaper, it still triggers the, uh, the upgrade, hopefully. And then that will be the final upgrade to Nooks. Moriland, now arriving at Moriland. Welcome to Moriland. Watch your step. Okay, so this is very weird. This is our town. And we're going to drop off the NES games. And the only thing we have to do here, pretty much, is to buy something. Welcome! Aren't you lucky? We just happen to be having a special event today. Free balloons for everyone! Oh yes! Is it going to be a different colour balloon? Welcome to my humble store. I don't have much, but take your time and look around, yes? What balloon did we get? A bunny pea balloon! Awesome! Okay, we might as well just buy a carpet. That's the cabin wall. It's very nice. Would you like to see it? Uh, no thanks. You don't want to see it? No worry. Either way, the price is 1,200 bells. Isn't it a steal? Oh my, yes. So care to buy it? I'll buy it. Thanks much. 1,200 bells. Thanks much. Please take this raffle ticket as a gift. No charge. The next raffle date is August 31st. I bet you can't wait. Awesome. So now, hopefully, actually, we'll just sell something to be sure. Yes, yes. What can I do for you? I'd like to sell. Very well, then. Show me what you've got. We can sell pretty much everything. Uh, oh, not the, we can't sell the Alola shirt. Flame shirt, we don't need a Stego Torso. Oh, do we need a Stego Torso? Hmm. I don't think we do. And I think we might even need a wing. So we'll keep the wing. There we go, that will do. If I add that, my price comes to 9,880 bells. Thanks much. Tell me, is there anything else you wish to sell? No, thank you. Okay, let's get out of here. Thank you, do come again. I look forward to seeing you. Oh, wow! A new balloon as well. So I guess we've got a couple of things to drop off for our actual t main town. Uh, oh, we oh no, we can't drop it! Oh, no! Um... Uh, can we put it in a letter? We haven't got any paper. <laughs> we just sold some paper. Is there any? No, there's no paper here. Oh, no. So 
So we might be able to put it in a letter. That's so strange. So we can't place the balloon anywhere. Oh well, I guess this character can keep a hold of the balloon. And we're just going to drop these fossils just in case we need them as well. Okay, so we I've, I, I don't think we should take his money. That's a bit too much. Okay, let's get out of here. That should have triggered the Nook's shop upgrade. So hopefully tomorrow um, the shop will be shut, which means we won't be able to sell anything or, or buy anything. But that's fine because we will be able the next day, hopefully, to see the biggest shop available in this game. The next train should be arriving any minute now. So let's get you ready for departure. Now going to save time data. I'm now going to save time data. Do not turn off the power. and Do not remove the memory card. Thank you for your patience. Your pre-departure preparations are now complete. And just in time, it looks like the train is pulling. I can't believe we can't drop the balloon. I mean, maybe we should see what it looks like if we let the balloon go. Seems we probably won't want to do it any other time. So maybe, maybe we'll have to sacrifice the balloon. And speaking of balloons, we haven't seen any other balloon presents for a while, have we? I think the third one floated across our town the other day. And it just, it didn't get stuck in a tree or anything, it just flew away. So we weren't able to get it. Bye, Porter. So this is Ian going back to crew. We, we only needed him really just to upgrade our shop. Oh no, Rover again. Thank you for boarding. We hope your trip is both comfortable and enjoyable. Next stop is Crew. Crew. Remember, when we arrive at our destination, please wait until the train comes to a complete stop before standing. Preparing for arrival, please don't turn off your uh, power or pull out the memory card. Thank you for waiting. The current local time in Crew is 5.32pm on August 14th. We'll be arriving shortly. We hope you enjoyed the ride. Come on, Rover. Slowest cat in history. <laughs> hey, whoa, unbelievable. You again, Ian. Certainly is. Well, if it isn't a wild whisker twister, don't you think it's weird us bumping into each other? What? What in the world are you talking about? You think I'm following you around or something? I'm not stalking you, Ian. What are you, completely insane? That would be so creepy. So anyway, are you coming from Moriland? How was it? It was fun! Moriland's the best! Yeah, I thought so. I could tell from the blissful look in your face, Ian. I feel something on your trip was fruitful, but I can't put my paw on what? Something, though. Something. Maybe the generosity of donating NES games. <laughs> oh, we're about to pull into crew. Don't the miles just fly by? Anyway, I'm glad to hear you had a nice trip. Be good. Okay, we're back in crew. Crew, now arriving in crew. Welcome home, Ian. Okay, we're gonna let the balloon go away. Ready? Oh, there it goes. That was not worth it. <laughs> More mail. Okay, I think that's it. We're going to now take a little break and come back in Moriland on our main town. So this is a bit weird, so I apologize for that, but we needed the upgrade. Now we're going to go back to Moriland and we're going to watch KK Slider's performance if we can time it right. So I'll see you in a few minutes. Okay, we are back to ourselves as Mori in Moriland finally. But we do have... Two new NES games, courtesy of Ian from Crew, who came to Nookway to basically purchase something and sell something just to trigger the update. Oh, so he's opened up after the special event. Welcome, do come in, have a look around, feel free to browse. Oh, wow, so you open, so you closed. <gasps> A pear dresser. So you closed for the day in preparation of the little event and then opened up afterwards. I didn't know if that was a thing. Or maybe it's because we saved and came off and came back on. I don't know. Well then, sh show me what you've got. We might as well get rid of all these things. 
Because I get... Oh, we need to save a couple of things for the camper, actually, don't we? Uh, no, but I do think we want to very much buy this pear dresser. That's so cool. Still, that price... Yeah, we'll buy it. Uh, and also, we want to take this chair. Because we've already got one uh, in our kind of upstairs. So we, we may as well get another piece of kitty furniture. Thank you, thank you. Okay. Oh, we need to double check the carpets. No, I was looking at the carpets. Exotic rug, yes. There we go, finally. How can you afford to let it go so cheap? Well, that's the secret of the shop trade. I'll buy it. Finally. Okay, so before we go and have a little chill to KK Slider, let's go and put our NES games upstairs. And also lay our new rug. Oh wow, that completely changes the tone of the room. That is... That is weird. It kind of makes a few things no longer fit in. Um, but we might have to work on this room, actually. Um, we're going to have to put some of our cards down here. Just wonder how many we've actually got in batches of five. Okay, so we've got a few. So we can... Grab one and put with that one. Grab one and put with that one. There we go. And then I guess we'll put the odd one over here. Uh, we actually want to keep this carpet for a little while because the tatami... Oh, it's not the tatami rug that we had from the other day. <gasps> so we could have bought the tatami rug from a villager. So these are the NES games. Oh, the pear dresser. Maybe we'll... Oh, uh, it doesn't matter. Actually, we can keep that down there. Because we might trade that with a camper on another day. And the kiddie chair we want to put upstairs, so... Okay. <laughs> uh, cool. Oh, we need to make way for the, some more NES games. These are definitely some of the best features of this game. That is so cool. I think, actually, we might have to rearrange a little bit and bring the table here as well. And then we can just place the... Oh! There we go. That makes more sense. All the games in the middle. That's really cool. Um, and then just for just for now, it won't stay like this, but we'll put another kiddie chair there because I do want to kind of merge a couple of themes up here, but we are running out of space already, actually. And then we've, of course, got our fruit, which I'm guessing we could... Maybe we could leave the fruit downstairs. Have we got any spare places on the table? Pair there. We might as well just chop the cherry here. Just for now. There we go. Oh, it's looking great. Okay, let's go and talk to KK Slider. Might as well pick up these fossils. No notices. Hey, how's it going? I drop by here to play my tunes pretty much every Saturday night. Want me to jam for you? Uh, you know it. Cool. If there's something you want to hear, just tell me the name of the tune and I'll jam. I'm talking about requests. Do you have a request? Yeah, we want to listen to KK Cruising, I think. Yeah. So we spelt it wrong last week, so we're going to try again. So KK. So we have to put the apostrophe on. KK Cruising. Far out. Get ready to jam, man. KK Cruising style. Enjoy. Quick, quick, 
That was awesome! Hey, thanks for listening! Let me give you the air check for KK Cruz in the air check. It's the recording man, the music. It's a pretty cool tune. You can dig it on the box at your pad. Later. Thanks, KK. That's so cool. Let's go and put it in our music box. I think it will fit in well with this room, actually. It has KK Rock in it. What do you want? We want to pop a tune. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what a tune. It fits perfectly. Awesome. I think that's the perfect way to wrap up this episode. Sorry it's a bit crazy, but we needed to get the traveler from uh, crew just to kind of upgrade our shop so that had to happen at some point so we may as well put it in with this episode but i think it was good we got some new nes games we saw kk slide and of course we found out what a, a tom nook sale is with wallpaper and got ourselves a balloon which is really cool so yeah thank you so much for watching and and just joining me in this journey, it's an absolute pleasure to play this game. And I hope you're still enjoying it. I'm um, sorry this week has been a bit uh, weird with episodes, but we will in a couple of days get back to normal with daily uploads. So I hope you're still enjoying it. And I guess I'll see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you don't miss out on any future episodes. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye!